Thanksgiving Day is here, and unlike last year, families are finally able to gather and celebrate. But with the pandemic still a factor, many headed to stores to buy at-home COVID-19 tests to make sure guests were COVID-free. Yet as Jonathan Monahan reports, finding the tests proved to be a challenge for some. I live in Whitman. No one, none of the pharmacies there had any available. This woman, who didn't want to show her face on camera, couldn't find a COVID test anywhere near her Whitman home. Everywhere I went, people said, oh, nope, nope, nope. Then I started calling, no, no, no. But 10 miles away at this Braintree CVS, she heard yes, finally allowing her to secure a worry-free turkey day. And there's no Thanksgiving dinner without what I'm told. Across town, we ran into this man who'd been searching all day. Yeah, I've been been to quite a few places. My in-laws live in uh, Pawtucket, Rhode Island, so I've been to, I went to four stores there and then I came out here. But not before buying them online first to secure them. He bought four to put relatives at ease. There's a few people in our family who are immunocompromised, so you know, we want to make sure that we're, you know, letting them know that, that we care about them and we're willing to go through some extra measures to, to show that. We did find a CVS on Grove Street in Braintree that had a small stockpile of COVID tests. But other locations were running out quickly. This woman, who also declined to appear on camera, came to that first location we found to get a test for her son. We're going to Thanksgiving dinner and my son's got like a head cold, so there's going to be babies, so I... Better I, safe than sorry. Yeah. And she locked out, getting there just in time. There's only two. You got the last two? I think so. 